Hey WWE Universe, long time no see. I'm gonna do a quick little video for today. It's gonna be a one taker, so I'm gonna try my best. Um, God, I'm old schooling it. Laptop, webcam. Feels like I'm in fifth grade again. Anywho, um, we're gonna talk about the Hall of Fame real quick right now. So, the only two time Hall of Famer right now is Ric Flair. Ric Flair got inducted for himself, and then he got inducted for the Horsemen, uh, the Four Horsemen. Now the second guy in the WWE history that's going to have that is going to be Shawn Michaels. Shawn Michaels um, already inducted for you know being him, and now we have led, we are being led to believe that um, D Generation X is going to be inducted to the 2013 class um, Hall of Fame. So. That'll make him a two-time Hall of Famer, so that's kind of cool. But you know what? I don't think Triple H has been a Hall of Famer yet. So, technically, this will be Triple H's first induction. And it doesn't really feel right to me, because, you know, he's already, like, said that he's done with the WWE, he's going to stop wrestling, and he says that he's just going to focus on being, you know, CEO and taking Vince and McMahon's job over, you know? So... Uh -uh, mm -mm, I don't know. I feel like he should be inducted first. And what about fucking Vince McMahon? They should induct Vince McMahon. He's done a lot for the company. Yeah, sure, he, he's a dickhead and, like, I don't know. They, shouldn't, uh, and they have a lot of people to induct. Like, fucking Mike Tyson? Mike Tyson should have been inducted. Sure, he is the first. He is a... He's not a wrestler. But he has wrestled, you know, like, back in the first, like, WrestleMania, so, I don't know, we got, like, like, some football players that are being inducted, that, you know, the refrigerator, with whatever the fuck his name is, like, he was inducted, and before Mike Tyson, like, what the fuck, Mike Tyson should be inducted before that guy, he was in the first fucking, like, main event, it was a big deal, it was a boxer versus a wrestler, it was like, ah! Anyway, so that's my thoughts on that. I feel like Triple H should be inducted before G Generation X. Um, and by the way, that induction will also include not just Shawn Michaels and Triple H. It will include uh, uh, Billy Gunn, Sean Waltman, and uh, Road Dog. So, I mean, it's kind of a, like, weird ordeal. Going on, um, we got Eve... She quit the WWE. She's claiming she's quitting, but you know what? Like, everyone says they're quitting, and technically they come back. So, I'll be waiting to see if she's legit or not. Um, I mean, why I say that? Punk. God, I'm. This phone's going off the hook. Punk, uh, said he was gonna quit. Doesn't quit. John Cena said he was gonna quit. Doesn't quit. Triple H said he was thinking about quitting a lot of times, and he finally did quit. Undertaker, uh, never mind. He did not say anything. Uh, moving forward, trying to get this wrapped up, uh, Eve said she was quitting. So, you know what? I don't give a shit about Eve. To me, personally, she is a red flag, okay? To be on a serious level, she's a fucking hooker. <laughs> I'm I'm sure she's a nice lady, but as her character is revealed, um, portrayed, sorry, is portrayed in that TV show, WWE, <laughs> um, she's portrayed as a uh, first-class skank. I don't know, she's hooking up with Dolph Ziggler, hooking up with John Cena, probably hooking up with everyone in the whole WWE locker room. That's just fucking disgusting, and in my book, guys... One of you guys has herpes, and one of you guys are fucked for life. And if she's got them, you all have herpes, and you might as well just get on the antibiotics right now. Um, so there's that. Um, kind of grosses me out when I see that, but you know what? Like, whatever. We'll see where she goes. She says she's going to start a reality TV show, but you know, I, I doubt it. <laughs> Bought this pipe for ten bucks. 
I haven't smoked anything out of it, but it just looks cool. It's like, I don't know, like, hanging out. Okay, that's me and my ADD. Hello, welcome to the Steven Hour, when he just shows everything that's wrong with them. He can't focus on one subject. <laughs> Anyways, um, so yeah, there's that. Um, Randy Orton um, is going after United States Champion at the main event. And you know what? I hope... Um, I, I don't, I don't think the title's on the line, but I hope one day he could capture the United States Championship. I don't think, I could be wrong, I'm not checking, um, I'm pretty positive he hasn't won the United States Champion, so that'd be cool, right? Am I right? Okay. Um, that was just a quick thought I had, um, other than that, you know, The Rock's back, I don't give a shit about The Rock anymore, um, now that he's back, but I'm happy he is, and, you know, tension between Punk and Rock. Nice. nice. Yeah? Am I right? I'm gonna go. I think I said all I want to say today. Leave a comment down below about anything I've talked about today, and I would really appreciate it. And just say you're like, oh, thank God Steven's back. <laughs> I don't know. Just say you were. Um, nope. Up here. Up. Up here. Um, is a, gonna be, um, a link to my channel. My vlog channel. Or the links in the description. All my Instagram, Twitter, and personal vlog channel. Um, I do stuff regularly on my vlog channel, so check it out. What up? I'm going to go. I'm Steven. It was nice talking to you guys, and hopefully we could go on this date again. And next time, maybe I'll light this candle. And we could kind of make out. Hmm? 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 Okay, I'm going to go. Bye.